good afternoon you guys happy what Friday today is Friday March the 1st you guys yes happy Friday March the 1st hey girl hey what it do boo you guys thank you so much for coming back to my channel if you are new here my name is Tiffany thank you guys for coming on Tiffany's touch go ahead and hit that like button go ahead and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so that anytime I upload that you guys will uh, get the notifications that your girl has posted a video. So anyway, you guys, I want to come on here because I'm kind of not feeling good. Went out last night trying to be grown, hanging out, and, and I'm tired. So um, I have a grocery haul. I have two. Um, I went to Aldi and I went to Kroger to pick up a couple things. So let's go ahead and jump into this haul, you guys. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start off with Aldi because that's where I got the most stuff. Um, price wise, y'all don't think I'm gonna go through prices because I told y'all I'm tired and I um I really can't remember them. But anyway, I'll definitely give you the total that I spent at Aldi. So I got grapes. I got some shrimp, and I love making shrimp and grits. I got some 2% milk, what, like a half a gallon? Yeah, half a gallon of milk. I needed more butter, so I got butter. And you guys, this is why I'm tired, because, like I say, trying to be grown and hang out. But um, I got some ginger beer from Aldi. I made myself a Moscow Mule last night. It was so freaking good it was it was really really good probably had too many Moscow news but they were really good nonetheless uh, I got some strawberries and I got yogurt you guys know I love to have fruit in the morning always for breakfast and I love to have yogurt and fruit with granola so good I got blackberries Y'all, I thought this is going to be really good today for a snack. This is Greek feta salad, and it has feta cubes with green and Kalamata olives marinated in herbs and spices, and it looks so good. I don't know if y'all can see it, but, and I thought that I would eat that today as a snack, or today or tomorrow, whenever, and also with some cucumbers. I thought that might be pretty good. So... I got some mango pico de gallo. I like to eat that like with um, on my salads and like with cucumbers as well and eggs on the side in the mornings. I got some blueberries. I got two mangoes. Normally I never buy mangoes, but um, I decided, you know what, I'm gonna give it a try. I see Jen Chapin here on YouTube. She do a lot of like grocery haul and food related stuff. And so I seen how she sliced them or whatever. Not that I don't know how. And they just look so good because she prepare them all the time, like every week for her family or whatever. So I was like, I give it a try, you know, and see if I like them or whatever. So I got two mangoes. And I think they need a little bit of time to ripen. I know that's one, but I know I got another one. I got some edamame. This is something I never buy. I've had it before a long time ago. And I asked my cousin, I was like, have you had it? And she said, yeah, and they're good. So... I decided to give it a try. You guys know I love asparagus. So I got some asparagus. I got squash. Here's my other mango. See, I got the, you know, I always get the cilantro lime one, but this time I got the sun-dried tomato and basil seasoned chicken, and this is seasoned, uncooked, boneless, skinless, sun-dried tomato, basil chicken, basil chicken breast. I don't know if y'all could see that, but that looked so good. I don't want to take it out of the packets, because I do like to keep my meat in the packets, but I thought that looked so good. So I got that, and I got... Some assorted chops. Got that. Y'all, when I say I had nothing in my fridge, I only got one pack of meat left, and that's 
from my last Aldi trip, the cilantro lime chicken. Other than that, I don't have any meat left. So I did do good. I did eat all my, my meat. Um, chicken wings. And I got two packs of chicken wings. And here's the other pack of chicken wings. me some meat so I picked up me excuse me I picked up me some roses I don't, I don't even know how much they were but I got some yellow ones and some peach ones I love having fresh flowers and believe it or not I used to all the time buy myself fresh flowers at least like every two weeks when when they die or always replace them I used to do that and I've gotten away from having fresh flowers in the home like I have plants but you know buying myself some fresh flowers and have them sitting out. So I decided to do that today. And I'm gonna put those in some water. Okay, I got some white bread. I got some exotic vegetable chips. These are gluten free, low sodium, and they're sweet potato, taro, batata, and parsnips. I get these all the time. Oh, well, I really used to get them all the time. And then I got away from them. But these chips are so, so good, y'all. So I got these. I got these. And this is a multigrain. And it's organic tortilla chips. Gluten-free as well. Made with whole grains. Made with sea salt. Made with corn, flax, brown rice, and sunflower seeds. So I like to have this with, like, chips and dip or whatever. I haven't had these y'all in so doggone long. So I decided to get them. <laughs> Sweet potato chips. These are so good. And now I'm kind of mad at myself that I got them because I also bought some sweet potato fries. Which you'll see that in a minute from Kroger, which was crazy. So I love sweet potato fries. I buy those now, the sweet potato fries, instead of regular french fries or whatever french fries. I love the sweet potato fries. And y'all, if you get it and buy this dipping sauce, let me show you. I think I have it here in the fridge, don't I? Yeah. I think I showed y'all this before. If you get it, get this sauce right here, the Great Value brand. This, this chicken dipping sauce is so good on fries. It tastes just like Chick-fil-A's. Chick-fil-A sauce. It tastes just like it. I learned this from Fallon on the Moss family. And I want to believe, I think her name is Leanne, I think. I think. I can't remember. Grady's mom. I think it's Leanne. I can't remember. She said it also as well. But I know I've seen um, Fallon on the Moss family. Y'all, this is, this is really good too. And it tastes good on nuggets or something. So... Those. Also got some bagels. I think I need to freeze half of these because I never eat the whole darn thing of bagels. So I got some everything bagels for breakfast. I got these. I used to buy these all the time um, to put in my friend's uh, lunch or whatever. But these are so good. And I seen, I like the way that, again, Jennifer from... Um, I forgot the name of her channel. Maybe it's Jen Chapin. Maybe it's just her name. I can't remember. But anyway, um, she made these also in her kid lunches with like sliced cheese and like almonds or whatever. And it's kind of remind me of the little thing that I buy from Walmart. The little um, PB something. But anyway, it has these and like slices of cheese and like covered almonds or something in the little pack. It's really, really good. So... Anyway, got those. Almost done, you guys. I needed more coffee, so I got some caramel cappuccino. I've never had this, you guys, from Aldi. Let me know down below if you've had it and if it's good, how you like it or whatever. So, I got this one. I got uh, French vanilla. I was out of 10 cups. My best friend, she likes this, 
So I picked her up one of these for whenever she come over to my crib. I got some honey because they did not have agave and nectar, which is what I like. I like that better. And I put this over my uh, fruit and yogurt in the morning and with the granola and all that. And I got some onions because I needed onions and I'm making a mess. I got this for myself. I love the Winking Owl. And this is that brand Shiraz or Shiraz or whatever. I got that for me. I like it. I like it a lot. I got two, I think, of these of the mango habanero. And again, I like to make this for like uh, chips and dip. And my cousin's coming over this weekend. So if she wants some, she loves my dip. I got cilantro lime. I've never had this kind, so I got that. Put that up so you can see it. And this is my other mango habanero. You guys, I heard that this was so good on fruit. So I got some and I said I was going to try it. And I got two of these for spaghetti. Yeah, and that's just the second one. Last thing from all of you, I think, yeah. Um, I got Granny Smith apples because I definitely like to eat these with um, peanut butter. So I got that and cheese as well. I like to eat it with cheese. I got a fresh pineapple. I love me some goat cheese. So I got this blueberry vanilla goat cheese, y'all, with some, like, little, um, rice water crackers or water crackers they're so good you see that i love this it's so good i got some kobe jack cheese for sandwiches i also got monster cheese which you guys know these two are my favorite that i get all the time i got some habanero jack and this is going to be for like snacks y'all when i say i have got to stop eating out which is why I did pick up a little bit more groceries than I normally do because, of course, it's just me because my daughter's in college. So, I find myself eating out too much because it's just so convenient to go pick up something to eat. If I'm being lazy and don't want to fix breakfast or cook dinner, it's so convenient to go get something to eat and not cook because I don't have anybody to have to cook for. So, But I need to stop because that's not being intentional. That's, that's being wasteful. So, oh, I thought my video had stopped. So, yeah. Um, cucumbers. And some Meyer lemons. These lemons are the best. You guys love these lemons. Love, 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 love them. How much time? We're on 12 minutes already. Sorry, I'm like all up in y'all face, but I'm, I thought the camera had stopped rolling. And I bought some little halos. So, that's all for Aldi. Kroger was something really small. I just picked up a few things um, that I, I don't get at uh, Aldi. I got some dressing, blue cheese dressing, and I think it was on sale. Oh, Aldi. Speaking of Aldi, what did I spend? Aldi. I spent $142. 42. 142, 42. That's what I spent at Aldi. Okay, Kroger. Blue cheese. Broccoli. Some broccoli spears. I do not like frozen broccoli. And I got some cereal for those late nights when you just want something, a snack or something sweet or something. So I got Frosted Flakes and Apple Jack cereal. chopped salad kit. I bought that. I got like a couple slices of uh, meat for sandwiches. I don't like to get too much and waste it so this is the Cajun smoked turkey and I love this and I got this from Kroger. This is the boar's head brand. I love the boar's head. I got Brussels sprouts and I got two of these. I cooked this what, about two 
minutes ago, sauteed it up. It was so good. So I got two of those. And some sweet potato fries. So you guys, that's everything that I picked up from Aldi and Walmart. So again, you guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you like my hauls. If there's something different that you want to see, leave that information down below. You guys, thank you so much. Please give this video a thumbs up so we can get this video some good views and get it out there recognized. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button. Hit the thumbs up button. Hit the notification bell. All that good stuff so that you can always see me. All right, you guys. Y'all have a great Friday. And have a happy and wonderful, safe weekend. All right. I see you guys back. I have some more videos should be coming up. I think I have a, a Walmart, a little small Walmart haul. I think. A couple things I picked up for Walmart. But, yeah. So, all right, you guys. I'll see y'all later. Y'all have a great day. Bye.